Chapter 13, Settling Accounts. What's up, everybody? My name is Crytek Kenbon. Welcome back to another Yakuza Kiwami 2 episode. We are back in Sotenbori now to continue the arc that is the Cabre Clubs. But before we do that, we got this chick to talk to because there was a, a sub story episode I did with Haruka, and Yuka is here to. Congratulate me and probably help me out, which will be nice. Hope she's gonna be really good. No offense to skipping all this. This episode's gonna. Oh wow, she's a silver. But this episode's gonna be different, and I might have to do a little grind sesh and a for real, for real one this time. But first, in the last episode of the Cabre Club, I did not show. Something that I did with Kana because due to time and everything, so I'm gonna show that now. But there's this girl too, still need to talk to. And you, I definitely want to talk to. Cause it's gonna be the first time we hang out. What's up, Kana? Actually, I was about to head out for a bite. You should come with me once in a while. Uh, should I go eat with Kana? All right, let's go. I love her voice a lot. We're going for sushi this time. Sushi, 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 baby. Ah, yes. Order as much as you like. You sure? That could be dangerous. Oh, no. Don't tell me you're one of those people. Oh, her voice is so cute. I love it. I'm actually a small eater. I don't lose at eating. I'm on a diet myself. Honestly, I like to pique her interest in the fact of eating. So, when it comes to eating, you know what I'm saying? That does not sound weird at all. Oh, she's going to That's not even funny how much that is. Oh my. Interesting. Your tea was too weak. You must have worked hard. Right? You had lots of friends, huh? Oh my goodness. She must have worked hard to get captain, to be legitimately honest. Oh, 
頑張って背中で語る必ずしいなそうですかでもそうしてもらえると嬉しいです放射員でもそんな風にみんなを引っ張れる存在になれたらいいなああカナならきっとできるさ失敗し話を聞いているとカナは昔から真面目に努力するタイプだだから前の店でも短期間でナンバーワンを取れたのかもしれないぜでも私なんてまだまだですよ魔術も技術も中途半端もっと上を目指したいんですけどね桐生さんどうすればもっとすごい手が上手になれると思います Keep those big spenders Keep working hard, get closer to the manager. Oh my. Let me not say anything that sounds too suspect, alright? I I would say keep working hard. But I don't I don't know what this would mean. I'd just just be pretty up for it about it and just keep working hard. <laughs> Your previous club failed you. You'll never feel alone again. I really ate my food, didn't I? I think you overdid it too. Huh? You're a force to be reckoned with, Kana. <laughs> I'll make you a big eater yet, Kuryu san. I had fun today, though. I'm glad I'm getting to know you better. Yeah, I feel like we're really connected. If you're really up for it, if you want to come out with me again sometime, well, I'm down, baby. Let's see how level up. Yes. Wow, she went up a lot. Now that we're back to reality, we're, we're going to be able to talk to her again, which is pretty exciting. So we're going to do this first, obviously, before we continue the executive league. So here we're going to talk to Kana again. You want to eat again? 
Should I eat with Kana? Uh, yeah, let's go, bit. Let's get it, boy. Everything smells delicious, Curry son. You really know your food. I wouldn't say that, but shall we? <laughs> yes, of course. What's better to say here in this situation? Because I've done karaoke in the first Yakuza Zero playthrough, but I don't know if I showed that on camera or not. But in all case scenarios, she wants us to say we go practice by ourselves, but I don't know what's a good choice here. I want to say this. <laughs> big eater right it's me right <laughs> a man chasing his dreams uh, a part of me wants to say this Play it is straight. Definitely mature and sexy. <laughs> this. Uh. 
I want to say playing it straight. ま、なるほど。自分の特徴を伸ばして個性にするってことですね。確かにそれなら無理せずにやっていける気がします。うん、そうだろ。でもしようかな。え、いや。それは別にいらないと思うぞ。そうだ、キリュウさん。同伴にも使えるおすすめのお店ってないですか？おすすめのお店。はい、私最近こっちに越してきたじゃないですか。だからまだ知らない店が多く
I just wanted to talk to you about something. Oh no. Sub story time? Talk with Kana. Sounds good. Let's go talk, Kana. I'd like to know more about you. Ah, we're in Shilika. Oh, this place is quiet. The atmosphere. Yes, it does have the quiet atmosphere, yes. Probably not the best place for a big meal, but he'll work for a conversation. Yes, thank you very much. One, I'm surprised you care about someone who doesn't like you at all, who actually is very toxic towards you. Obviously, they didn't like you, but you care about this person to some degree, which is interesting. Why don't you help her? Why don't you ask her to stay out of her business? I want to see this one. I should have said ask her. This calls for a hug. <laughs> I still blame your senpai. You really mature. Thank you. 
さんそれにしても今日はカナの成長を感じる日だったぜそうですか自分ではよくわからないですけどそう言ってもらえるなら嬉しいですこのまま成長し続けて将来的にカナはどんな感じになるんだろうなどうですかね自分としては10年後ぐらいにはキャバ嬢以外の仕事についていそうな気がしてますなぜそう思うんだ私手も小さいしもっと綺麗な子はたくさんいますから。My wife. <laughs> dude, these answers are so ugly, dude. What? It sounds so extra and so cliche to say that. It just sounds like, why? And the manager of Fortune, that sounds a bit excessive. I want to say I t a l k to your hostess. Because you're working under Kuru. You. Your boy going to do it right, alright? You're definitely one of the best. I wouldn't sell that short without saying so. I feel the same way. I want a girlfriend like you.、Uh, th this unfortunately does not sound like a lot of good answers here.、Um, hmm. The last time I had an answer like this with Koyuki, however, it worked out. So maybe I'll try it again. Did I just say that? Did I really just say that? Bruh. Wait a minute. So that answer did work out for itself. Thanks for hearing me out today. I'm glad you're feeling better. I'm glad I could talk to you about it, Kuryu san. I mean it. Thank you. <laughs> you're working my hardest. So don't take your eyes off me. Okay. 
No coins. Ah, the level ups are good. Kana's at a good level. I just want to get Aika up a little bit. So, since he's at 17, we'll see where it goes from there. We are already at the highest earnings for her. So, maybe I can do one more, maybe two more. And I don't know if I should just make an Omega cut, but I probably will. So, I'll catch you guys there. <laughs> All right. I got to say, <laughs> what what the heck is this? What, what is a tycoon? I could look it up, but obviously, a lot of people can't do tycoon. But I find it very strange. What is the tycoon type? If anybody knows what it is, please tell me. Please let me know. I don't know if I'll ever get the answer from the comments anyways, but I will, however, find this out for myself. So, yeah. Sorry about that intermission, but I had to say something. I've never seen that before. One more match later, and Kana already got her sub story for us. You know what that means? It's time to talk to Kana again. Let's go. Kuryo-san, are you busy right now? Why? What's up? I know this is vague, but I'd like you to come with me somewhere. Uh. Sub story time. You know how I told you about one of my old cook words who I got a job nearby? Yeah, so to how she wasn't getting along too well with her manager. Well, she can't shake the feeling about meeting up with her. Could end up going badly. So, pretty much. It's all, but all you can do is just confront it. That's all you can do, and I'll be there for moral support. So your old car worker works around here. Oh, she's in the old hair. Yeah, pretty sure. Oh, there she is. That's Masumi-chan. Uh, it looks like she's in an argument. Uh-oh. <laughs> what was passed down? Okay. You roll up to our club with that stuck-up attitude. It's rude to us. And it trips up our customers, you know? That girl to the left? What is that? I'm sorry. I'm about to uh, call you out, bruh. What is that face? <laughs> You're not even a woman to me. <laughs> what is that face? Your eyes are huge. Your nose is huge. All you miss is, is some fish lips and it, it just completes the package. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, tripping like that in front of a whole club. Get it together, huh? I only trip because your foot was sticking out. Hey, are you accused to Tomomi of tripping you on purpose? That's pretty serious accusation. Ah, uh, yes, we get it. You're a bitch. And I got what you need. I did get fired, but it was my fault. I was jealous of a girl who worked hard, and I pulled her down for it. Oh, but when it was over, I realized how shameful it had been for her. I regret all the things I did to her even now. So now I'm trying to walk in her shoes. No matter how tough you make my life, I'll do my best just like Connor. I can't believe it. Yeah, can we just take her to our club, please? What? What's up to mommy? Huh, Masaru-kun. This chick is talking shit. Uh, is you know, she's a real bit. I'm gonna give her a piece of my mind for it. Oh, sure, I can handle it. All right, buddy, that's where you gotta stop. Don't you lay a finger on her. I'm Connor. Who the heck are you? I'm Connor, an old friend of his two returns, and I won't let you hurt her. Connor, what the heck? And multiplying the thinker up for a double trouble with Saku. <laughs> oh, she's a real kitty. I know exactly how to handle these two. Uh -huh, you forgot. Oh, whoa. Wait, what is that stance? Only a scumbag think that she could solve a fight between women. Oh. Yeah, it is kind of messed up for a guy to try to do that, uh -huh. but. Yeah, I'm gonna have to whoop your ass. A manager, a bodyguard, it doesn't matter. If you want to hurt them, you're going through me first. Get beat, bitch! <laughs> Impossible! 
You was Wasaru. No way. You don't even know who you're fighting, buddy. If you even think about harming another hostess, I'm gonna be there. You got that? Uh, yeah, it's real clear. Yeah, get the way out of here, boy. Hey, don't leave us with him. Here you go, son. Thank you. Yeah, that was about to get bad. Sorry, Kuryu-san. Uh, Kana? Sumitan. You're not hurt, are you? Kana. I'm so sorry. Those are terrible things. I blamed it all on you. If I, I was such a despicable person. If you can... I feel like anybody who can recognize their weaknesses and their problems and try to better themselves for that, I think I could respect somebody like that rather than continuing to be a bad person and not realize that. Sumi chan, it's okay. I think you know how I feel now. I wouldn't wish that on anyone. As far as I'm concerned, apology accepted. If you wanna shake on that? It would lighten up the moon. A handshake? Yeah, put everything in the past. Be really good friends. So, can we really be friends? Can you work at our club though? Our Calibrary club. Aw. Heh. <laughs> well, I say we celebrate with a meal. It's on me today, Kanatan. Oh, interesting. Wait, did you say a meal? Are you sure, Masumi chan? She eats like Goku. Now that's a problem. I'm just kidding. Yeah, it's the least I can do. What would you like? Mmm, how about this, this, and this? Okay, just sushi. I thought she was gonna have like a whole freaking. <laughs> whole. Freaking ladder just scaling all the way down, like Boy. the whole entire thing, all the way down. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. My mind is just somewhere else. What do you mean by that? Sushi with Kana is dangerous. I bought no less than 200 plates last time. She actually is freaking Goku. All right, she eats like that. <laughs> oh my god. 200? Oh, what? Otro Ikara Otro Ikara Uni Otro Uni 200? Oh no. <laughs> Sumi are you coming? Oh, sorry, let's uh, take a rain check. <laughs> I thought we're friends now. <laughs> friends who sure has a child, huh? Uh, they sure do, Kuryu. Ah, of course, I, to my knowledge, I turned to my left right after to see that this chick also has got to talk. I'm very interested in her voice because I love <laughs> her, her attitude and personality is very unique compared to what I've ever seen from a Japanese person in a video game even. So I kind of like her too, but the problem is, I'm not going to do it for this episode. We'll leave that for next time we do another Cowboy Club episode. I want to continue the grind, so I'm not going to focus on her for now. Okay, I think we did pretty good. We ended up beating a last record. So yeah, I think we're ready. I also forgot to mention, I found the max amount for the... I think every hostess's max level is 40. So that's very interesting. All right, Club Fortune versus the League Champ of the Comorcho Divine Queen, which I forgot her name. Oh yeah, Shoko. There we go. All right, we're doing pretty good. I believe we can do this. Let's do it with this loadout. Let's go. At last, the Executive League Championship. I can't believe we can only have six of us out there for this. We'll have to work twice as hard. I know it'll be tough, but I also know you're capable. And as always, I'll support you the best I can. I actually think we can do this. I have all confidence, actually. <laughs> Greeting the club for Sean. Kazaki. A little pretty told me that you were hit with a penalty tiscus. Think you know better? Shut your ass up. We didn't do anything wrong. That's what the guilty always say <laughs> as they're dragged away in the chains. 
Be glad your sentence is only to lose to us today. Why don't you agree, Shoko? Hey, yes, sir. So you're Shoko chan. Claim to your so called bonds as you wish. The perfect queen desires an execution, and she shall have it. In truth, I want to exact a heavier penalty and see you expelled from the tournament, but that wasn't satisfying. You're the one who got us penalized. Oh, wow, could you be any lamer? Huh, sling as many insults as you like. You're just a butterfly caught in a spider's web with no hope for survival. Yeah, with the fist across your face and up your ass. <laughs> Though, I might forgive you if you get down on your knees and beg. Huh. Hey, you bastard. Yo, Shoko, you cool with this? I could, son. What happened to your pride, girl? Can't call it a win if you stoop to this troll's level, can you? Aika, I'm sorry. Say what? My orders are to beat you definitively, and Kazaki-san's plan is just the means to that end. Spoken like a real robot. <laughs> you see, Aika-chan, unlike you, Shoka here has a brain. <laughs> Dumb up. I'm just kidding. But enough of this banter. Let's put an end to this raid and have a friendships and dreams. Yeah, you're welcome to try. Ah, I see you in the background, my guy. And now, let the curtain rise on today's dramatic battle. You will be mine. Let's get it. All right, we're starting off with Koyuki. All right, so we're all gonna be doing good here, boys. All right, all right, poor people. I guess I will give you to the weakest link. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ranch wants funny, but I can use media for this, which I would do. But I might just throw Aika in there for the mix. This is what Aika looks like now. She's looking pretty good if I say so myself. So let's go. Okay, towel. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, Kuryuki. If I may. Customer, you have gotten what you want, so enjoy, sir. Hmm. All right, we got another rich person that wants sex, and uh, I guess Kana can do the trick. Even though I feel like there's gonna be something else involved very soon. Hopefully not, but let's continue. All right, swap ash. This is a close battle, man. This is interesting. All right, I didn't think it'd be this close, but holy crap, is it close? <laughs> I'm actually quite worried because this could be closer than I ever imagined it would be, but I think we can do this. Ah, uh, we have a tycoon situation, boys. Ooh, I can try something though. I think if my thoughts are right, let's take the chance. Alright, alright, I think we'll be okay. Extend it. Yes. Tycoon. Thank God we kept Koyuki here. And now we can use her. Thank the gods. <laughs> Holy. I'm getting real worried because she hasn't used her fever and she's getting a lot easier than we are. Which means we could have a big downfall here if we don't get this beat before it's too late. Alright, I will use Aika here. Gotta help this person, give them that towel, yes. We're doing good, but I'm nervous. I can actually just straight give them Kana. I'm sorry, but you're getting Kana. Oh no. Extend it, yes. What e oh! Oh my god, they took all my girls away, bro. I knew I was gonna get hit with something big. We're still winning by a lot though. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. They want Koyuki. Alright, get the Koyuki. Whew. I still think we won this though, bit. Let's go! <laughs> yeah, oil bear in the house. Just, let's, let's smash the button. I'm already ready. 
The party set? Let's go. Stella boy, we are amazing. Club for shine, man. We won by a landslide. We won by a landslide. Like, dude. <laughs> they never stood a chance. The Millionaire League promotion, boys. And that's what I am talking about. Get your level ups, girls. You definitely deserved it. And the winner is... <laughs> Give it up for the new Champions League Executive League. We did it! Oh yeah, boy! Korea Sanyo, we pulled it together just like you said we could. Uh, yeah, I have faith in you guys. I actually had like, a lot of faith. Confidence is understandable, but... <laughs> I apologize for this. Nah, you're gonna be one of us. Don't worry about it. You made it to losing despite the handicap on them. Seems I overestimate your capabilities to no small extent. The Kanzaki group has no place for a queen of incompetence. What a joke. <laughs> Ugly. Yeah, now walk it out of here, bit. Now, about uh, Shoko-chan over here. Do you want to become one of us? Oh, wow, Saika. Yeah, but... Were you going easy on us? It felt like it felt like you were going easy on us because every time she hit level one on the fever, she did not use it, and I was confused. May be able to fool Kazaki, but I know the real Shoko has better mood than that junk you were throwing out. I wouldn't say I went easy on you. I just kind of lost out there. Lost? Yeah. I guess it's caught up with me, bearing my emotions and killing my real self, playing the perfect queen. Shoko-chan. Why on earth would you hide who you really are? In spite of what you've heard, there was a time when I was more natural and I let my emotions show. When I got into this job, I wanted to show customers a real human, not just another hostess, but I was naive. I got dr a drunk customer at my table and then he got violent. That's terrible. From then on, I was scared to show my true self, so I kept my emotions hidden and put on a fake smile. I perfected my service skills, ensuring I never made such a, a single mistake, pretty much. All to avoid the trouble with customers. That's how I earned the title Perfect Queen, and my popularity only shot up from there. But I couldn't keep it up. Even I even talked to Kanzaki-chan about it. He said that my only asset was to be the allure of a queen. Told me to kill my real self if it bothered me that much and to show up to work as only the queen and you did it but wasn't that asking the impossible of course I struggle with it but that's what the customers wanted too and it's not my job to make them happy so I thought I'd make made the right decision until I saw Forshine us? what? You guys seem to really enjoy your work even Kanata and Aikachan are thriving here. And to be honest, it made me jealous to see you two. Meanwhile, here I was agreeing to a plan to trap uh, that trapped you, all while protecting the championship with my fake self. I can't help but feel empty, I guess. I really did want to have a fair match, and I'm sure the doubt I was feeling is what threw off my focus. Zaki sounds right. I'm a joke of a queen. Nah, you are amazing and yeah. you're gonna be one of us. Is that how it's supposed to be? What? You smile when you're happy. You get angry when things go away. And you cry when you're sad. That's real life. There's nothing wrong with playing a part, but not at the cost of your true self. So you lost your composure. That's the real you, right? And I bet you have more charm that way than under a mask. Curry song. Nobody's ever said anything like that to me. <laughs> hey, I think that frown just turned upside down. Look at you go, Shoko. Turns out there is a human under those circuits. Hey, no teasing, please. <laughs> but Aiko's right, you know. That smile we just saw was ten times brighter than any queen's. Thank you. Shoko-chan, listen, 
Why don't you come work at Fort Sean with us? Yes. You'd have me? Yes. <laughs> She's clapping. Oh my god. There's so much someone like you could teach me. Uh, there's quite a lot of things that could happen. We go all kind of time. And there'd be no objection to that from you, right, Curry yeah. son? You're right, but I do have a condition. You're only allowed to the service customers as the real Shogun. You don't have to be perfect. I don't even care if you get into fights with the customers. But you've got to face them as Shoko the real human woman, not Shoko the perfect hostess. Do we have a deal? Yes, of course. Thank you very much. And welcome aboard. Oh, yeah. I say this call for a party. Oh, good idea. I'm sure Curry san wouldn't mind paying. I find this as a mistake. I'm aware that now Kanatan eats like Goku, and that's a problem. <laughs> yeah, thanks for covering this one. I didn't agree to anything. I feel bad for Curry, but I do have 12 million yen, so I could cover it, maybe. Hey, don't I get a say in this? Of course you do. All you have to say is, yeah. <laughs> I, I can't believe this. I feel bad. <laughs> Amazing. So the Millionaire League is the only one left standing. It seems you've finally been cornered, Kanzaki-kun. I feel like we're going to get into an actual battle. I'm waiting on that. I, I apologize. No need for that. As long as the Grand Prix stays exciting enough to bring in audiences, I could care, care less. That's awfully glib. If I go, so does your under the table cut. How do you feel about living under your means? Well, since you put it that way, I suppose you're right. Unfortunately, for Fortune, they'll have to lose. I didn't want to resort to drastic measures, but as you said, we share a common fate. Alright, I'll leave it to you. And on my side, I'm going to turn up the pressure. Oh, sounds delicious. I look forward to seeing that. I wonder who that unknown man is. <laughs> I don't know. Now, she's the last one, right? She has to be the last one, right? Uh. Kiara? Indeed, this time will be different. All the same, this time I have backup plan as well. Uh. And what do you mean by pressure? Haha. <laughs> uh -huh. I've already got Yoda san on the case. Look on the table. Ah. Uh. I swear if you hurt her, I'm going to kill you. That's Kuyuki-chan. What are you planning? Oh, Kirara. Wait until you see her fortune. You've gone far enough. I swear if you hurt her, bro. He's given the order. That plan I mentioned. Yeah. Time to bust a move then. You got this, Yoda-san? If you don't. I know. We can't fail. I've got this. So just leave it to me. I swear if he hurts her, I swear to God. Ah, now this place is coming to life. We can still talk to your girl over there. We can now use eight hostesses again, I, I think. I hope. I should talk to them and see if there's anything left to do, but... Shoka... I am so excited to put you on the squad, so I'm quite excited about that. So before we do anything, let me see if there's anything left to be done. Yes, there is. We're finally down to our last league. From today on, we'll fight through the Millionaire League. I take it all of our opponents will have cash to burn. Pretty much. These clubs attract the rich and elite. Money flies around like a bubble that never popped. Which means it's going to be extremely easy for me to get money. So this will be pretty good. So I might even do another episode. What do you guys think about that? But the clientele makes the girls jump over the highest hurdles. If the team has any weak spots, they'll find them. I can see why they saved this league for the last. The champ is Kenichio Platinum Hostess. Has an ace in the hole too. The natural hostess or national hostess or sub U each on the U mm -hmm. Wait, I thought it was Kiara. Yeah, I, I can't say her name. Or maybe that's her last name. I don't realize it. She's practically more idle than hostess. People say she has an aura of mystery and charm about her, and that the only way to beat her 
is for your own clothes, Ace go to corner that aura with her own. This is why they're after Kuyuki. I swear, if something happens to her. Or signs Ace. Kuyuki, I, I hope you're not being self-conscious, because you actually are my best girl. You were on fire, Shoko. Watching you work is like poetry in motion. Uh, for sure. It's easy to see how you earned the perfect queen title. Hardly, Kana-chan. You're a natural, and I only wish I could be as hyper as you, Aiko-chan. I'm jealous. It's an honor to be working amongst some of the finest in the industry. I'll have to work harder to even keep up. Pfft. You're laying it on in a little thick, girl. But still, when Shoko drops a compliment, I'll take it. Uh, right? Going to be a fierce battle for the top with you two around. I won't be slacking off either. Koyuki, are you really being self-conscious? That's not like you. Or at least in this situation. I thought we'd been through this already. Hmm. That worries me. Something's bothering her. <sighs> You're right. But why? I wonder. Everyone's so amazing at this job. I got into this because I wanted to be what Yuki-san was, but I'm nowhere near that level. Kana-chan, Aika-chan, Shoko-chan. They're so good at this, and they're beautiful women on top of it all. I make so many stupid mistakes. I'm frumpy next to them, and the gap was only widening. I don't know if I'll ever be the ace Yuki-san was. Now, am I hearing myself now? I am not pathetic, you should be saying that. I've got to keep my head held high and aim to get better. Now, problem number one. Kiryu-san. You heard of yeah. kiryu -chan? No, not lately. She's not answering her phone. And we were going to make... Shirashi today too. Uh, she's not the type to not show up to work. Yeah, I think this is a first for her. I wonder what happened. Maybe something about work is what was bothering her before. I guess we'll have to give it, give her some space. Oh no. Same here. Oh my God! What the heck? Cabri Club Grand Prix. Koyuki has gone missing. From here on out, you will have to battle without her. Oh my god. What? This is unfortunate. But thank you guys for watching the video. Make sure to nuke the like button, subscribe button to the channel. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the bell so you'll be notified when the video goes up on the channel. I am trying to stay consistent with these uploads the way that I've been doing it so far on this series. And I'm enjoying this series. So I can't wait. Either next episode I can continue the clan creator or I can continue this. And I might do back to back this time because I really want to see where this goes. We're almost done pretty much. After the championship league, we're pretty much at the end game. So this is probably the final league, I think. So this will be the last time we'll have to do this and then every single time after that maybe i can do episodes where i'm talking to the girls because i'm probably gonna have to talk to all of them right which is okay but we'll see when we get there it's gonna be interesting cause i need to get every single sub story done in this game and let's not forget majima we're gonna continue his arc very soon i was thinking about continuing and or finishing Curry's main story before doing majima cause i have a feeling that's what's gonna happen but, if all things don't go the way I want them to, I might just see where it goes from there and continue it sooner rather than later. But, we'll see you there when we get there. But for now, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.